Omnisphere and Trillion give you an easy way to mark your favorites. Although the features presented in this tutorial are shown in Omnisphere, they also apply to Trillion. Omnisphere contains more than 7,000 sounds, and with a library this huge, it's possible to get lost. The features described in this video will enable you to organize the sounds to match your needs, whether you work on multiple projects at the same time, or need to have a few sounds ready for your live gig, or you simply want to have quick access to your favorite ones. This tutorial will be very helpful. It's possible to rate the sounds in the library with the star rating system. And by simply clicking next to the name of a sound, you can rate it. It's that simple. To remove a rating from a sound, command click for Mac or control click for PC right on the stars. You can also click to the left of them to remove the rating. Now here's another great thing. It's possible to sort rated sounds by selecting that option from the sort menu. This allows you to have your favorite sounds at the top of the list. Now, ratings are great, but let's say you're rating the sounds while you're setting up for your punk band, and then when you set up for your wedding gig, all the sounds you rated don't really apply. For cases like this, it's more useful to use the projects function. Now, let's say I'm working on a video game. So, from the project menu, I'm going to create a project. I'm going to call it video game and it's going to show up in this list along with all my other projects. Now I can start browsing and when I load this patch which I want to use in my video game project I can simply tag it like this. That's it. If you take a look at the menu you'll notice there's a check mark next to video game. That means this patch is now assigned to the video game project. All right, now let's try another one. I want to use this one in my video game as well, so I'll tag it like this, and there it is. That's it. Pretty easy, right? Okay, now let's suppose that while I'm browsing, I run into a patch that I could use on another project I'm working on, like a dance remix. Say I run into this sound here. create another project and I'll call it dance remix and since the sound is already selected all I need to do is assign it to the dance remix project from the project menu it's really easy when I select show projects which can be done from the project menu or by changing category mode to project mode I can see all of my projects with all of the sounds I assigned to them including the two projects I just created. Now, in order to erase a project, it's just a matter of selecting it from the Delete Project submenu. I'm going to delete the Dance Remix project. When I do that, I get a warning letting me know that this doesn't erase any sounds from the library, it just removes the tags that are associated with this particular project. Next, I hit Return, and that's it. The Dance Remix project is no longer in my list. The Ratings and Projects features will allow you to manage the huge amounts of sounds Omnisphere and Trillion have according to your needs, making your workflow a lot more efficient.